My name is Audrey Bays. I graduated from North Stafford High School in 2006, and then I went to Germana Community College and graduated there with liberal arts in 2008, and then I continued to University of Mary Washington with an anthropology degree, and I graduated in 2010. I decided to join the Peace Corps in my, about my freshman, sophomore year of college, and I just applied and got accepted and found out I'm going to Ukraine to teach English to high schoolers. And what inspired me was um, I've always been into volunteering, and I went to Honduras with the students helping Honduras, and I fell in love with volunteering, helping out anyone I could and as an anthropology major um, I've always been interested in culture and going to another a foreign country such as the Ukraine I'd be able to develop skills such as you know uh, teaching English obviously and I'll be able to come up with like certain challenges I want to establish a soccer league over there and um, after school clubs for teaching English um, so I've always been motivated to help others and this is a two-year commitment which is a very long time for some but for others um, I know a few friends of mine who have done it and they all have come back saying it's the best time of their life so I'm really excited to go and I can't wait to leave until September so now the Peace Corps has been around for about 50 years and John F. Kennedy was the one who started it uh, but I think a lot of uh, people in this generation may not be aware of what the goal is. Can you tell me what you're hoping to achieve when you go over there? Yeah, definitely. We, um, as a volunteer, my goal will be to establish a sustainable project, So, which is why the two-year commitment is so long, because it gives you a year to actually begin learning the language, and then you have a year, year and a half, to actually establish a sustainable project. Mine would be teaching English, but there's numerous projects. There's agriculture, there's science, computers, health, HIV, AIDS, awareness. There's so many different opportunities for so many different degrees that it is able for anyone to really go and commit to. And the other goal would be to do outreach to let people know about the Peace Corps and the cultural understanding of another um, another country and to share that through the Peace Corps, which is why um, over 50%, and I included, is going to do, it's called a school-wise program. And what you do is you reach out to a high school in America, and I will be doing a high school in Ukraine. And so through me and the teacher of that classroom will be sharing letters, photographs, stories, in order to better develop that understanding of the culture. Do your friends think you're crazy? What do they think about you doing this? <laughs> um, sometimes just because the 27 month is a big commitment, and, um, but they're all really excited for me. Uh, they're happy. I'm gonna, I mean, I'm gonna have a going away party, so I mean, they're all excited and they love to volunteer. They understand why and uh, where I'm going. They understand my passion for helping others, so they're excited for me. Do you think your generation is uh, one that is more interested in uh, doing uh, in volunteerism and helping people, whether here or abroad? I do, definitely. I think um, through my contacts, most of my friends and everyone have actually gone either just locally or abroad to help out, but I think the desire comes from knowing that there is a global world, it's with globalization they know, you know, that there are, I mean half the world lives on less than two dollars a day, so as we get more aware of that and our, learn that in our schools, I think people actually want to start reaching out and helping in any way they can, even if it's local. So, um, yeah, I definitely think it, that there is this desire to help out more. I think that the problem is, though, that there's a lot of students don't know that there's like such like Peace Corps, there's Teach for America, AmeriCorps. People don't know about these options, so they do like a career right after college or high school. But I think we need to get an awareness out there, just knowing that there are different options that you can volunteer at, which 
offer great benefits too. Like the Peace Corps will offer, you know, helping to pay for my master's program. So it's definitely a alternative to a career right out of high school or college. And wh uh, what are you planning to do as a career and do you think this will help you in that career? Um, I plan to get my master's in business with a nonprofit uh, concentration and I plan to work for USAID and I think that this will definitely help me in that track because as a USAID you are going to a foreign language you need to know like other languages and you're going for to a foreign country and so you need to know the skills and you need to have these experiences so USAID definitely likes volunteers that have done the Peace Corps before so I think it is a good opportunity for me. Will you send back some reports and let us know how things are there and how you're doing? I definitely will. I plan to send back letters and um, actually I'm going to write in a journal uh, every day and I plan to write a book when I get back on my experiences. A lot of people, a lot of volunteers have done it and I've read quite a few so I think I love to write and hopefully in a few years it'll be out. <laughs> well thanks Audrey and good luck. Thank you.